If you've ever wondered what a fan looks like before you put it together, well now you know. That is not right. Oh my god, why is it so long? God, no one's ever asked me that. Huh? Oh. oh, okay, I see, I see. Perfect. Alright, let's see if it see if it fucking turns on. <laughs> I think, I think it's on backwards. There we go, there we go. Okay, it's lined up. It's like Perfect. Perfect. Now, why, why did I just show you guys me building a fan? I have no idea. But no, I did it for this reason. Watch. <sighs> See, we got the we got the bum here, and see, it's for her. And we got one of these. All right, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be watching the boys. The Boys, Season 2, Episode 1. We're already on Season 2. Now, in the last episode, pretty crazy episode. You know, because we found out the truth about Homelander. So, so Homelander originally went to Dr. Opal to find out the truth about, like, what actually happened. And he told him, he told Homelander a story. Then Homelander went to Stillwell. She told him a story, and, like, it was kind of similar but there was one detail missing and that was that Stillwell said yeah a miscarriage is horrible but but the way the doctor described it it wasn't a miscarriage so that's that's how Homelander knew she was lying to him and then Butcher lured Homelander into Stillwell's house to you know try and blow her up and take what and take away what's important to Homelander like Homelander did the Butcher right but then Homelander just pulls a fucking Uno reverse car he's like I don't give a fuck about her and he just kills him kills her himself and then but then Butcher still blew it up but then I, I'm assuming Homelander just saved him right there and took him outside but then he took him somewhere else Turns out Becca's not dead and Homelander's kid is not dead. So Butcher really has no beef with Homelander anymore except for splitting them up for eight fucking years. <laughs> like he hasn't seen her in eight years because of Homelander. So like, that's really the only beef he has. But I mean shit, at least he see at least he can see her now. And so I'm excited to see like where things pick up in season two. Because I feel like most storylines got resolved. You know, like there's really no beef. Maybe all the beef butcher had for the soups was because of homelander and it's like well that solved itself you know so it's like okay well is he are they like cool now or like what like what's good or is butcher still trying to take them all out he's probably still trying to take them all out i don't know we'll see but anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode of the boys if you'd like to watch the full interaction that'll be available on patreon as well. early access to the next two episodes will also be on patreon so let's get started yeah i just got a new bracket on the back of my tooth right here on the top and bottom and it's fucking killing me dude i took a bite of a chip of a chip and my entire like body just froze because how fucking bad it hurt like i literally like i li like like my body literally took a screenshot it felt like oh my god it was the worst fucking thing ever like the, literally the worst pain i've ever experienced <laughs> not gonna lie i did kill the last one off camera after that intro so, I'll open another one. I'm on page 134. Chain oh, Moff Gideon is probably taking over Stillwell. <gasps> oh. Spicy chicken cilantro rest. Is that Nor? Half our own heroes don't know they have compound B in their veins. Yeah. Yeah, it is Nor. <gasps> oh, oh my god. Holy shit! What casualty allowance are we looking at here? Zero, of course. But cone of silence? 
34%. Yeah, that was the last soup from episode 7, the, the soup they showed in Syria. Oh shit, it didn't do shit to him. Oh. I mean, no, fuck them all. Oh my fucking god, what a goddamn transition. That was nice. What What is Nord's like actual powers? Like, I, I have no, I, I don't know anything about him. <laughs> okay, he's not gonna kill the fucking kid. All right. More than a fallen member of the Seven. Oh, uh, so now they're admitting translucent. He died. He knew something was gonna happen. He said, <laughs> "There's just nothing in the casket." <laughs> I, I mean, I get they don't have the body, but like, <laughs> I think it's supposed to be because he's invisible. Even though, okay, okay, I guess he doesn't have beef with Butcher anymore, but he still knows Huey killed translucent. So is he still gonna do something to them about that? Or does he just not give a fuck? Cause like he he made up another story about how he died. So it's like technically it doesn't have to do anything. Ooh, Starlight. I love the hair. Damn, she has a really good voice. It's actually her singing. <laughs> oh no. The deep. He looks like he's down bad. Ah. Oh. Hey, that's my shoulder. What? <laughs> right. They crop. They cropped him out. Can lava fall. I said it's time to go, or I call TMZ. Ooh. Isn't she the best? You both. Have Dude, where the fuck is Huey? <laughs> looks like he's in a goddamn dungeon. <laughs> Bro, that's a dungeon. Oh, her hair was fake. Wow. Oh, yeah, A Train. I really hope he doesn't die. Okay. <laughs> oh, Frenchie is running an operation through here. Oh, there's Mother's Milk. Oh, Billy the Butcher? Why is he on the newspaper? He slapped down, down. Down. Sorry, I just... Oh, uh, this is how they have to see each other. Wanted and you're kind of super famous, so... Uh... Oh, he's wanted? Makes sense why Butcher's on the newspaper. Yeah, I'm lying. I'm sorry. You look like... <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's been awesome. <laughs> Phone parties will change your life. Okay, that's why he's in a fucking dungeon. Because they're, they're hiding. Oh, shit. Is that Tom Holland? He's an actor who didn't lie to my face. <laughs> <laughs> it was business, sweetie. Sleep when I know you're safe. Ooh. I think water's supposed to be fun. Swimming <laughs> in the Mariana Trench, little fucker. Bro. <laughs> yeah, that's so fun now. Bro, what is he doing? Oh my god. He's so good. Dude, he's so down bad. Fuck, I feel bad. No, oh, he's in jail now. Okay, wait, why would Huey say to Starlight, I'll sleep when you're safe? Like, I think they kind of just dropped this off in the middle of storylines progressing and like, I don't know. Because I feel like, I, I know I didn't miss something, but I feel like they just dropped this off in a spot without like exploiting any, anything. Cleveland, we met like five times at VodCon. I mean, mm, it doesn't matter. <sighs> it's awkward. Why? Because even heroes need a hand once in a while. Oh, uh -huh. nah, he just needs something from you. The translucent franchise. <laughs> my baby needs a mother. Boy. Oh my. He murdered Vaude Vice President Madeline. Oh, oh. East wife, a former Vaude employee. Yeah, I guess I have to cover up how Stillwell died. So okay. No, he's too much of an asshole to die. <laughs> Okay, yeah. So Homelander did expose all of them. So I guess Homelander must have took a, uh, must have taken in Butcher after he like, showed him the bucket and his kid. 
Hold on, just kid. They got 31 flavors of semen on them. You'll love them. <laughs> we bring it to the New York Times. We burn Vought to the ground. You got some VU. That's what we tried to do last season. Kind of. Get some. Someone could help us get it. You did not hear that. Still. No. Starlight. Who's going to be our captain? You? Yeah, I guess Butch is locked up or something like that. Bad. The fuck up. Chill, daddy. Uh. Oh, wow. He took off his gloves. I think that's the first time he's taken them off. That's like the first thing he's ever taken off from his costume. Actually, no. He took his pants off when he fucked Stillwell. But. No, bro. No. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. Dog. Bro. Ugh. Bro, we don't know. Why is the sound? Oh my god. The sound on that. <laughs> oh, she's back. Ashley. <laughs> I was so surprised to get the call. Oh. That's why she's back. Miss Stillwell shoes as best I can. I mean, you got the same attitude. <laughs> so. Any luck catching your killer, that butcher maniac? Oh. Okay, they don't have him yet. It's not it's not locked up. Okay, homeowner's not doing it on purpose. Why? <laughs> Lead the way. All right, let's see him. A blind spot. He looks good. Wow. <laughs> that's a, that's see, impressive. Is he actually blind? What happens if, um, I don't know, I do this. <laughs> oh my God, I love you. Oh. Oh my God, so much blood's coming out. It's this fucking blind guy. That's fucked up. This must be some kind of a joke. Homelander, why would we... God. I would ever allow a cripple into the seven, for fuck's sake. Bro. Look at him, look at me. Ashley! Look at me. Which means you answer to me. Okay. Oh, okay. Include my own marketing and write my own talking points. You, wow. You decide who goes in the seven. Fuck. Do we have... Bro. Oh my god, Ashley looks so intense. Oh my god. Alright, so Hope Blender is fucking comfortable. Holy shit. Never acted like that before. In front of like his co -work co workers, you know? But uh, damn, alright, he just wants to min control everything. So that's why he made Ashley. That's why he gave Ashley still his job, because he could just tell her what to do. I mean, it's smart. All right, that is definitely not Tom Holland. The cleaning bill. What are they gonna do? Are they about to kill someone? An arm, please, actually. Wait, what do you mean by that? Um, He's about to cut his arm off? What, is he like, does he regenerate limbs or something? He regenerates limbs, so he just sells them? <laughs> uh. does, he, does he not feel that? Just keep it refrigerated. Yeah, P yeah, he can regen. One extra ground, I'll let you chop off my dick. <laughs> what if his head gets cut off then? That can Can he regen his head? Okay. I guess he's not selling limbs, he's selling the experience of cutting his limb off. Hey, hey, hey. <sighs> Holy shit. Oh. Oh my god, what the fuck happened? Frenchie, what'd he say? Yeah, what'd he say? Okay. What, did he tell Frenchie how it happened? And that's what they're gonna go check out. Oh, fuck. Okay. I feel like she has some kind of connection to that. I kind of remember her doing something like that. Fucking like human fucking cargo jesus christ frenchy god i mean i feel like they would mention it if they were going to do <laughs> nah. oh he's a soup so whoever did this to him is a soup okay i was wondering how the bow got tipped over oh okay Peter Smagalina, soup terrorist. yeah I was just, okay i was about to say something like that well fuck i'm saying 
Super villain is the better term. It, super villain can't go wrong with that. Do you prefer? <laughs> well, Ashley, Ashley hates him. It's saving America. I I don't know. I I feel like saving the world has a. Well, technically, they're not allowed outside to operate outside of the U.S. That are gonna keep us in the army, not the fucking world. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey what? oh shit you scared me. <laughs> we've all been there stuff been where rock bottom <laughs> okay why is he helping him out he wants something out of him so many arrows a quiver can hold yeah just ran out damn Hostages died. We lost a lot of good people that day. Yeah. Fucking arrows against tech nines. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Art. Carol helped me see that. Really open up, D. No, I don't. Open up. You know what? I don't know what the fuck this is, but it's weird as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. Help you get back into the seven. Ooh. Now you got his attention. What the fuck? Oh boy. Dude, I wish she could talk so bad. I want her to actually have lines too. Cause I like her. The last time we don't need butcher. Then what? Oh wait, I just remembered in the last episode, episode eight. That was part of their deal is they're wanted. Okay, I'm so fucking dumb. She literally told them that. The last episode. Okay. Bob has her phone. So bugged, they're praying that you do that. He already did. I texted her. Oh. Well, I can't finish. That Vermont country dollhouse. <laughs> Walking around for days like you want to kick my ass. So do it already. Mm. I don't want to kick your ass, Huey. I'm just stressed. I just don't want to get dragged back into this shit, all right? Yeah. I want to get home to my wife and my kid. Yeah, that's all he really cares about. You're just a kid that sells stereo equipment. No, I don't. Look, Huey doesn't have to do something about it, but he wants to do something about it. Now all I have is this. Yeah, that's all he has. Just really fucking depressing, but it's true. So maybe I can't be Lee Marvin, but I could be Harry Potter. <laughs> or, or, or what's her name from uh, The Hunger Games? Katniss. Katniss Everdeen? Person that nobody thinks is awesome. But it turns out they're kind of fucking awesome. Yeah. Boy, shut your trap. I do like how they show the TVs in the show. Makes it feel like a real world. That passion play we put on, you were the best Jesus. I mean, no one's gonna take a nail through the hand like I can. <laughs> There's nobody in the sky watching over us. Damn, she lost faith. Not God, not Homelander. Damn. I need you to go into the labs on 67 and Steal me a sample of Compound V. Ooh. I, uh, I don't know what that I is. I don't know what that is. Yeah. He does, but he's trying to cover. I get you. I you have to. Or I put this on Facebook tonight. Oh my god, yeah, video. <sighs> I'm hooker. As a side hustle. Oh, he looks pissed. I thought that we were fun. I'm sorry. We're not anything. Wow. I mean, if anything, couldn't he just report her? And be like, like, he'd be like, hey, Hellmanger. See what she's making me do? She's making me get a compound V. She could deny it, but he did say he's a nobody, so it's like, who would believe him? Oh, FYI, not a real base. Oh my god. Lander and Maeve are gonna eat MREs and piss him in. Stormfront official. <laughs> They just wanted me to meet you. Oh. I'm the new girl. Wait, what are you talking? Uh, the new seven. Hi, I'm in the seven. Yep. Ashley, whoa, Ashley. God bless his soul. Jesus Thanks, Christ. <laughs> Mage's fucking reaction. <laughs> oh no. Uh. Uh, who wanted to go tweak on her when he's not on camera? Yeah, who? Who? Mr. Edgar, the big guy? Uh, okay. 
Wonderful. Yeah, I guess he has to listen to him. It wasn't actually. Stand fucking Edgar. <laughs> Where are he going? Stormfront. I don't really. I don't have good vibes about her. He's completely ghosted. Do you think he killed yeah. Madeline so well? I'd like to think that he didn't, but. Mm hmm. Hear about your family? Mm hmm. Your daughter is uh, starting soccer, I think. Oh, okay. Good for her. But he obviously. he Yeah, he wants to be there as a dad to support her and stuff. The sneakers probably from Taiwan, maybe India. <laughs> got all that from the video yeah how do you know <laughs> not and i think you just handed it to me oh, okay okay so then what's the whole picture the whole picture it's bought it's yeah yep uh mammy knows oh shit why is she <gasps> what the fuck what the fuck <laughs> what the fuck that low-key scared I oh my what? 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 God damn, dude, I really liked her too. Fuck, she had a nice voice. What the fuck? <laughs> well, it's cool. obviously someone from Bot who did that to her. They're just watching him, listening to that conversation, and she she caught on to them. She realized it was Vaughn, and then boom, gone. For which you have my undying respect. See, I don't think I do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I dare to try and pull this kind of shit. Oh, adding stone front. He's gonna press him for it. Fucking camel jockey in the middle of the Sahara, he's gonna turn around and say, Homelander, in perfect America. Oh, wow. Maybe it's time I uh, move on. And do what? How do you think your sheriff? would feel about that. <laughs> he has that fucking Moff Gideon look. <laughs> he's, he's not Biden, bro. Frederick. Vaughn. Who is that? The fucking founder? Our esteemed founder. Oh, yeah. Okay. In 39, Hitler appointed him chief position of Doc. Wow. For which we condemn in the strongest of possible terms. Early in 40. Mm -hmm. And he became as wonder bred American as Disney and Edison. Wow. Be fascinating, if not slightly condescending lecture. <laughs> we are not. What we are really is a pharmaceutical company. Are not our most valuable asset. That would be our confidential formula for compound D. Yeah. Which you so you can just replicate. If he leaves, just replicate a new one. Mind you. You slipped compound D to terrorists all over the globe to get you and your cronies. Mm -hmm. And I don't appreciate that the FDA now knows about compound D. Oh. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before the public finds out. While you're preening at the Golden Globes, we... now, I believe you have a premiere of Tech Night Live <laughs> to go to. Goddamn, he just fucking put him in his place. And he is pissed. Oh. Okay, I'm assuming Bush is with Becca, and this is their house. You better have tacos. <laughs> Cause just because it has like the same like color grading as it did last time we Yep. What are you doing here? I need Butcher. Come to see my son. Oh. Guess Butcher's not with her. Eh, we don't know that yet. She says something. She wants balls too. Yep. Somebody from Bot. Hmm. <laughs> Probably. We did it. He's getting me the compound V in like a day or. Two. Oh, why would you say that over the phone? New York Times. I mean, I was thinking. But I mean, shit. Let's fucking go. We've been waiting for. Let's burn those fuckers. Fuck yeah. Just take a beat. Let's figure out the best. But after, yeah. It, you gotta be careful. I don't want you getting hurt. Yeah, after what happened with the CAA lady, he's like, oh, let's chill. Let's chill. Don't lie to me. Just don't say it over the phone. Damn. I'm not. 
Ah, uh, but he is. Oh. Whatever. I um, I gotta go. Yeah. Bro, you could tell her I trust her. But I wouldn't tell her over the phone. The fuck. The fuck. Oh, right. it, Easy does yeah, it's fucking Easy. butcher. I was, I was, I thought it was him, but then I saw the, the pants, and I was like, "What the fuck?" What the fuck are you wearing? <laughs> yeah, what do you wear? It's not a game now. Yeah. We need a real captain. Yeah. If we were missing butcher, it. This is a fucking mess, son. <laughs> we can worry. Daddy's home. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking a butcher. Ah, uh, here he's pissed. All right, well that was season two, episode one. All right, all right. So that was the boys, season two, episode one. Pretty strong episode for episode one. You know fucking deputy director Reyna got her fucking head blown off. I was like, dude, like, fuck. I really like her, too. She was cool. Fuck. So, okay. I definitely think Bot was listening to them have that conversation. And as soon as she, like, realized, oh, shit, Bot did that. Bot brought that soup villain terrorist into into here. Boom. Head gone. Head gone. So, maybe Bot's li maybe, dude, maybe they're listening to everything. Because, like, that was something that just triggered it like she just had to say that then boom triggered like there had to be someone watching and listening to be like okay bye okay you're dead boom you know something like that and our boys are all wanted men that are they're the most wanted men in america and you know in this episode I definitely did feel a little bit empty without butcher so i'm glad he did show up at the end at the end i was thinking like okay this has to, this literally has to be butcher like who else could this be and then i saw his fit like the pants and i was like wait it's not butcher, <laughs> but then it was him. I said, "Bro, what are you wearing?" <laughs> like <laughs> sick jumpsuit, but and so I guess Homelander just kind of outed Butcher for killing Stillwell, cause like yeah, you gotta cover that up somehow, and like I guess that's the only way to really explain it is to just blame Butcher on it, make him look like the bad guy. So everyone else, they're all wanted men, and it's like fuck. Okay, mistake me if I'm wrong. But I'm pretty sure in like episode eight or seven. Reyna did say like part of their deal was like yeah you know you're the most wanted men like you're gonna be wanted for this like she did say something like you're gonna be wanted for this something like that you know I'm a little fuzzy on that but if I'm not mistaken I thought she did say something like that and then Starlight is blackmailing Gecko this new guy we got introduced to to get her compound V and so they can expose Vought for her but Huey kind of seems like oh he's kind of rethinking everything after seeing Raina get her fucking head blown off it's like maybe he's probably thinking like dude that's gonna happen to me if like we do this so he he's a little hesitant now and like he didn't really tell Starlight like that over the phone which is a good idea like don't don't say shit over the phone like if, if you're gonna tell her you gotta meet her in person that's probably why he didn't tell her I doubt it was because he just didn't want to tell her. It had to have been like, yeah, I can't tell you this over the phone. And like, maybe he couldn't say that over the phone either. So, because like, he's just assuming the phones are tapped. So, but yeah, that was The Boys Season 2, Episode 1. Comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.